Hey Cougs, I'm Jalen Mason reporting from the Fertitta Center because basketball is back. Houston is getting ready to take on Hofstra. The Cougars are coming off of a huge season highlighted by a Final Four appearance. Houston is a top 15 pick in the AP preseason based on their performance last year. In familiar fashion, Marcus Sasser got things going with a three, but the offense slowed down from there. The Cougars are typically known for their rebounding, but were shaky starting off. After a shot clock violation on Houston, Hofstra had all the momentum leading 17 to seven. Coming out of the timeout, the threes reined in from Sasser and Kyler Edwards as the Cougars tried to close in on Hofstra. Two back-to-back -back offensive boards followed by a putback shifted the game. Jamal Shedd found Edwards for a three and Houston was back within a score. But foul trouble kept Houston just out of reach. Hofstra led 37 to 31 at the end of the first half. The shots went in on both sides with Hofstra keeping the steady lead. Sasser knocked down both free throws followed by a jumper and the score was 47 to 42 early in the second half. But Hofstra kept it going with the second chance shots and went up by 10. A big three pointer from Sasser brought the score to 62 to 57. Moore checked in once again to sink the three, followed by a drive from Sasser. With three minutes left, it was a four-point game. From there, Sasser found Shed for a dunk, making it a two-point game. When Hofstra put up yet another three, Sasser went in for the layup. With a minute left, Houston trailed 69-66. to Shed created a steal, and Moore was there to tie the game at 69, with 23 seconds left. A defensive stop from the Cougars meant the game was headed into overtime. Sasser opened up the extra five minutes with a corner three, and Shedd followed along with one of his own at the top of the key. From there, Houston was in full control. Late free throws from the Cougars cemented the 83 to 75 win. This team's this team's uh, is going to be on upward trajectory. Now, had we played uh, a bad team tonight, one by 30, everybody would have run out here, start and start thinking we're better than we actually are. You know, so I'm glad we played a good team tonight. And I'm, first of all, I'm thankful to win. But I'm also thankful we struggled. All right, that's all we have for you guys today, Cougs. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Jalen Mason, and we'll see you next time.